Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. As you can see, it's a little cold out here. Yeah, it is. You can see that, eh? And guess what? I finished washing the truck. As you can see, my whole driveway is wet, but uh, yeah, it's not super clean, but uh, at least we got all of the uh, dirt and grime and mud off of it, I think, for the most part, anyways. We had a lot of soil on here before and as you can probably see if you saw maybe yesterday's video I think or maybe the days before I think I was talking about it and yeah look at that we washed it all nice and clean well, as clean as we could get it and she's looking all right today well look at that cloud that's looking misty today they are sort of talking about maybe uh, getting a little bit snow later on this afternoon so yeah and I was gonna go out today but uh, we didn't get no load yet and it sounds like there won't be any today might only be tomorrow by the time we get a load but let's look at this side I mean just look at the difference from this rim to the rims there in the back that's just amazing how much brighter this rim looks hey eh? even the same on this other side you know like look at that look at that the brightness on these new rims compared to the ones here in the back and remember i only polished these ones a couple of weeks ago like maybe a month ago maybe or so and even the tank too well i guess it could look a little cleaner if i had uh, wiped it off with the towel or something like that but we didn't do that so i mean that's all right no i'm tired I've been working real hard. I've probably been washing the truck for about an hour and a half, probably. And so we got we parked the car over there because I parked the truck here before because I was uh, washing the whole driveway off, you know. So, but uh, anyways, we'll go get the car and then uh, we'll go inside. Well, guys, we did not get a load today. And that sucks because now I'm going to be stuck in that snowstorm tomorrow because we did get a load for tomorrow. We'll be going to uh, Dryden, Ontario, and then to Moorhead, uh, Minnesota. And we're only planning on going on a short trip because uh, our daughter, uh, we can leave her in Winnipeg uh, once a month, usually for about one week. So we usually like to take that opportunity to have some time for ourselves. So uh, what we do is sometimes, uh, not all the time, but sometimes we will uh, leave our son at our friend's place or something like that and then we'll uh, go to Winnipeg maybe just me and the wife and we'll have a nice dinner together and uh, go watch a movie my wife uh, really enjoys that as well you know so uh, we uh, we plan on doing that this coming up weekend here so that's why I told dispatch I need to be back for Saturday so hopefully they'll get me back from Moorhead right away you know but I'm a little, little worried about tomorrow, you know, might be bad roads there because uh, I looked again on the internet there and it looks like there's a bad storm heading our direction, but uh, oh well, I guess we'll just have to deal with it when it comes and go from there. And the bad part about it is I have to go to Dryden with an empty trailer. Now, if it was with the load, it would be all right, but I have to go there with an empty trailer on a slippery, windy road, you know. That can be dangerous, asking for trouble sometimes. <laughs> but we'll try our best. I'm just going to take a real easy, if that's the case, and uh, hope for the best, I guess. But anyways, uh, stay tuned for that, and then we'll see you guys again tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching.
love listening what he has to say. That's right. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come.